Well, we can. Dude, sir, mic band, sir, mic band. Very disappointed in you. You forgot oh. that we are vampires, right? For the day. Yeah. We are the guides to these wonderful people through this event. Good evening and welcome to everyone present here. On behalf of Connexion 2022 and this year's Student Council, we welcome everyone to the spook fest of an event, the Open Mic 2021. Let's give a round of an applause. You guys know, XI in engineering is not only about pointers, but behind the scenes, it's a talent. It plays a very deep role. And to know this more, let's just dive ourselves into these talents. I'm very excited for this event. Are you all? Comment in the section. So let's begin with a huge round of applause for all the beautiful and amazing people present here. You guys better respond, OK? Otherwise, I'm going to haunt you all. <laughs> Okay, so beginning with our first participant to kick off this event is our dashing and charismatic Sumit Sharma, who has a song for us. Hello, everyone. Hello. Hello, yeah, we yeah. can hear you, we can hear you. Yeah. So can I start now? Yeah. Yes, yes of course, course. the stage is yours. Yes. Yes. Gulabi aake jo teri dekhi sharabi ye dil ho gaya sunhal mujhko o mere yaaro sunhana mushkil ho gaya gulabi aake jo teri dekhi sharabi ye dil ho gaya दिल में मेरे ख्वाब तेरे तस्वीर जैसे हो दीवार पे तुझ पे फिदा मैं क्यों हुआ नाता है गुस्सा मुझे प्यार पे मैं लुट गया मन के दिल का कहा मैं कहीं का ना रहा क्या कहूँ ओ दिल रुबा बुरा ये जादू तेरी आँखों का ये तेरा कांतल हो गया गुलाबी आँखें जो तेरी देखी शराबी ये दिल हो गया मैंने सदा चाहा यही दामन बचा लू है सीनों से मैं तेरी कसम ख्वाबों में भी बचता फिरा नाज नीनों से मैं तोबा मगर मिल गई तुझसे नजर मिल गया दर्द जिगर सुन जरा ओ बेखबर जरा सा हंस के जो देखा तूने मैं तेरा बिस्मिल हो गया गुलाबी आँखें जो तेरी देखी शराबी ये दिल हो गया संभाल मुझको ओ मेरे यारो संभालना मुश्किल हो गया That's it guys thank you thank you so much Damn, that was a rocking performance, Sumit. Thank, thank you so much. Thank you so okay, much. Okay, so now can I ask you a question? Yeah, yeah, sure. Who so was the song the really for? <laughs> <laughs> it's difficult for me to reveal the name, but uh, yeah, there was. Oh yeah, yeah. Was is the person is here? They uh, will like to know the person is here. 
Okay, sorry. Thank you, thank you. Thank you. Mm -hmm. By the way, guys, do you know how beautiful poems Kushbu writes? It's even there in her Insta handle, and she's even the head editor of the magazine committee. So let's call Kushbu to recite a poem. Over yeah. to you, Kushbu. Thank you, Rikin. Am I audible? Yeah, yeah. Yes. Yeah, so uh, today I'm going to. Hello. Yeah, yeah, audible. Okay, so today I'm going to recite a Hindi poem. The title is "Or Tum Kehte Ho Dashera Ko Hamne Ravan Ko Chala Diya." So can I start? Yes. Yes. Mandir banao zara us Ravan ka jisne nari ka daman na chua. Mandir banao zara us Ravan ka jisne nari ka daman na chua. Dar jijak raha aakhon mein beti ke aur tum kehte ho Dashera Ko Hamne Ravan Ko Chala Diya. राम तो तुम भी कभी नहीं थे राम तो तुम भी कभी नहीं थे छोटे कपड़ों पे तुमने भी कीचड़ उछाला जब बारी तुम्हारी सोच की आई जब बारी तुम्हारी सोच की आई और तुम कहते हो दशहरा को हमने रावण को जला दिया रास्ते पे कोई खुलेआम घूमता रहा सीता को उसने यू कुचला रास्ते पे कोई खुलेआम घूमता रहा सीता को उसने यू कुचला आठ साल बाद दहन बड़ी मुश्किल से हुआ और तुम कहते हो दशहरा को हमने रावण को जला दिया नारी सम्मान ने रामायण महाभारत करवाया नारी सम्मान ने रामायण महाभारत करवाया पर एक जान का कर्ज यहाँ मोमबत्ती ने चुकाया मर्यादा में रहना सिर्फ लड़की को ही सिखाया मर्यादा में रहना सिर्फ लड़की को ही सिखाया और तुम कहते हो दशहरा को हमने रावण को जला दिया हर दिन यह दरिंदगी की दस्तक दे रहा हर दिन यह दरिंदगी की दस्तक दे रहा पुरानी स्याही सूखने से पहले अखबार एक नई खबर लाया पुरानी स्याही सूखने से पहले अखबार एक नई खबर लाया न्याय की देवी ने भी अब डर से सिर झुकाया न्याय की देवी ने भी अब डर से सिर झुकाया और तुम कहते हो दशहरा को हमने रावण को जला दिया और तुम कहते हो दशहरा को हमने रावण को जला दिया थैंक यू थैंक यू सो मच वेल थैंक यू खुशबू दैट वॉज सर्टनी वंडरफुल एंड एज यू कैन सी द चैट बॉक्स इज फायर अप सो फैंटास्टिक सो नाउ फॉर आर नेक्स्ट परफॉर्मेंस वी हैव मिस न्योनिका we all know about her singing and guitar skills don't we our ags is multi talented and has a melodious voice so let's welcome nyanika shetty thank you nyanika it was indeed melodious but wait before we all continue don't you think it's a little unfair that we are the ones with the camera why don't you guys keep your cameras on it will be very wonderful yeah 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 please come on put on your cams on i can see so many people without the cameras on where sharon gone sharon chennai Come on, guys. Then shout out. At least you aren't your camera by my constant yeah. barking. <laughs> okay, we can go ahead now. Yeah. For the next performance, we have got a cool-headed CR of SA Coms, and along with him is our encouraging ACS Glenn, 
who will perform a duet for us? Hey, I'm Glenn. Hey guys, I'm Moses, and we're gonna sing a duet on Supermarket Flowers by Ed Sheeran. Here we go. I took the supermarket flowers from the windowsill. I threw the day old tea from the cup. Backed up the photo album that you had made. Memories of life that's been loved. Took the Gavel soon cards and stuffed animals. Bought the old ginger beer down the sink. Dad always told me, don't you cry when you're down. But mom, there's a cheer every time that I blink. Oh, I'm in pieces, it's tearing me up. But I know a heart that's broken is a heart that's been loved. So I sing hallelujah. You were an angel in the shape of my mom. When I fell down, you would be holding me up. Spread your wings as you go. And when God takes you back, I say, Hallelujah, your home. Love the pillows, made the bed, stacked the chairs up. Folded your nightgowns neatly in a case. John said he'd try and put his hand on my cheek. I wiped a tear from the side of my face. I hope that I see the world as you did. Cause I know a life with love is a life that's been lived. So I'll sing hallelujah. You were an angel in the shape of my mom. When I fell down, you'd be there holding me up. Spread your wings as it goes in. God takes you back. We'll say hallelujah, you're home. Hallelujah. You were an angel in the shape of my mom. You got to see the person I have become. Spread the wings and I know when God takes you back. He said, hallelujah, you're home. Thank you. Thank you. That left me speechless. Well, I think the guys should take lessons from them. And they really sound very similar to Ed Sheeran. Don't you all think so? Comment in the chat. Oh, man. <laughs> Well, thank you from my and Moses' side. Now, our next participant is very insightful and is very passionate about music. So presenting to you all the rocking and ever cheerful Pratamesh.
thank you, Pratamesh, for that gem of a performance. Okay, so for our next performance, we have a duet. And for that, we have Crystal, who is a perfect at everything that she does. And along with her, a fellow musician, Pratham. Let's hear them out. Tastes like strawberries on a summer evening. And it sounds just like a song I want more berries And the time I feel it It's so wonderful and fun The song was just beautiful and that intro for which we gave for them was all perfect. Well, Glenn, do you have any idea what our next category is? Okay, uh, so what is our next category? We have a monologue. Oh, so then let's just call the man himself, Tanmay, who will be putting things into perspective. So Tanmay, over to you. Thank you. Listen, bro, I found that nothing in life is worthwhile unless you take risks. Nothing. In my life, going to school, then selecting my stream, choosing engineering and selecting the trade. Many told me engineers often end up jobless, have something to fall back on. But I never understood the concept of having something to fall back on. If I'm going to fall, I want to fall forward. At least this way, I will see what I'm going to hit. I ain't afraid to fail big, dream big. But dreams without goals are just dreams. Let me tell you something you already know. The world ain't all sunshine and rainbows. It's a very mean and nasty place. And no matter how tough you are, it will beat you to your knees and keep you there permanently if you let it. You, me, nobody is going to hit hard as life. But it ain't about hard, how hard you can hit. It's about how hard you can get hit and keep moving forward how much you can take and keep moving forward. That's how winning is done. Thank you. Sorry, Tanmay, to keep you waiting, but that was wonderful, you know. They say everything has its first, you know, but that was reliable. Thank you once again for a wonderful description of your monologue. Thank you. Thank you, Ritin. Can you just stop it, Glenn? Please. You have oh, just I... destroyed the whole concept of beatboxing, man. Oh, man, aren't we here to have some fun? I was just having some fun, oh, oh, man. Okay, okay, okay. Enough of the fun we had. Now let's just hear Rowan doing what he does the best. Oh, yeah. Nice, nice.
This is how embarrassment feels like, I suppose. <laughs> Thank you, Rowan. It was a mind-blowing performance. And uh, you even restored our faith in beatboxing after the disastrous performance by me. So thank you. Now, moving on to our CR from the comms department, Moses, along with Chanel. Now, doesn't it seem like Moses has some love for singing? So let's just hear them out. Hi, everyone. I'm Moses Fernandez. And I'm Chanel Athayad. And together we're singing If the World Was Ending. So let's begin. I was distracted in traffic. I didn't feel it when the earthquake happened, but it really got me thinking. Were you were drinking, or were you in the living room chilling, watching television? It's been a year now. Think I figured out how how to let you go and let communication die out. Cause I know you know we know you went down for forever and it's fine. Cause I know you know we know we one man for each other and it's fine. But if the war was ending, you come over, right? You come over and you stay the night. Would you love me for the hell of it? All our fears would be relevant. If the war was ending, you come over, right? The sky be falling and I hold you tight. And there wouldn't be a reason why. We would even have to say goodbye. If the war was ending, you come over, right? Right. If the world was ending, you come over right, right. I tried to imagine your reaction. It didn't scare me when the earthquake happened, but it really got me thinking. The night we went and drinking, stumbled in the house and didn't make it past the kitchen. Oh, it's been a year now. Think I figured I have how to think about it without it ripping my heart out. And I know, you know, we know you and I for forever and it's fine. And I know, you know, we know we were meant for each other and it's fine. But if the world was ending, you come over, right? You come over and you stay the night. Would you love me for the hell of it? All our fears would be irrelevant. If the, if the world, world was ending, ending you come, come over, over right? right. The sky be falling and I hold you tight. No, there wouldn't be a reason why. We would even have to say goodbye. If the world was ending, you come over, right? You come over, you come over, you come over, right? I know, you know, we know you were down for forever when it's fine. And I know, you know, we know we were meant for each other when it's fine. But if the world was ending, you come over, right? You come over and you stay the night. Would you love me for the hell of it? All our fears would be irrelevant. If the world was ending, you come over, right? The sky be falling and I hold you tight. No, there wouldn't be a reason why. We would even have to say goodbye. If the world was ending, you come over, right? You come over, you come over, you come over, right? Thank you. Thank you. Well, that was a very touching performance. And since we all are doing engineering, every day seems like the world is ending. But sadly, Erikan, you want to add something to it? 
Come on, man. This song was so romantic. Yeah, I know. Romance ke liye time nahi milta, yaar. Moses, what is this? You are burning us, single people. Kya hai ye? Is Moses here? He must be giving that smug smile somewhere, you know. Oh, he's in the chat box. My bad. Oh man, you made us feeling very jealous. Oh, there he is in all Halloween mood. Nice. Okay, let's move on. That was a very yeah. wonderful performance. Yeah. Thank you. Of course, Lindy. I believe that poetry brings out the essence of the person, and this is very Priya, who from time to time has surprised us with her skills. And it's now here to recite a poem for us. Let's all hear her. Hello, everyone, and a happy Halloween to y'all. I'm Priya Harshay from SCEXCC, and today I will be doing a poetry recitation of a piece called Pride, which is written by my best friend. It goes like the disconnection to my deepest truth birthed my insecurity. Societal expectations cradling me, slowly smothering me until I become one of them. You see, I'm not one of them. I can't be, though sometimes I wish I was. I wish you had accepted the fact that gender is as colorful as the sky you want to baptize me in. I wish I could find love by being a floating puff in the air, by being myself as the wind shapes me without conforming to the dark clouds of your ignorance and phobia. I become one with the sky as the sunlight hugs my identity, creating a warmth of self-actualization in me. For you cannot tell the sky to stop being blue. You just appreciate the fact that you can witness it in all its colors. happiness, claiming your truth in you. Don't tell me my edges are in the silver lining to this already messed up, supposed to be round world. Don't tell me your god isn't an ally or the rainbow wouldn't be a spectrum. Don't tell me to calm my chaos just because you are standing in the eye of the storm. I will only stop when I reach the horizon of my soul. I wish you were here for the sunset where the calm meets chaos. I wish I was the serenity you taught me to be. But I know the world is a better place when I become a thunderstorm. Wow, that was such a beautiful description, and wasn't it amazing, Rekin? Yeah, it was. You know. Yeah, thank you, Priya, for sharing with us such a nice poem. It really had a very deep meaning. Yeah. Our next performance is from the calm and at the same time enthusiastic person, oh, Supriya yeah. Mohite. So let's hear her sing. Dua bhi lage na mujhe, dua bhi lage na mujhe, jab se dil ko mere tu laga hai. Nind raato ki meri, chahat baato ki meri, chen ko bhi meri tu ne utha ga hai. Jab saase bharu mein band, aankhe karu mein nazar tu yaar aya.
Wow, that was such a beautiful voice. It was incredible. Thank you, Supriya, for that performance. And now moving on to our next participant, who not only has passion for music, but he also possesses some mad tabla skills. So let's welcome the tabla master, Mr. Anirudha. Wow. You know, I was lost for a second. I was just vibing with that tune, you know. It was incredible. Man, you should definitely take the blood classes. Yeah, man, he should. Should indeed. Yes. That was great. Uh, now it's time for some energetic performance. And for that, I would like to call upon our ATS, Faran. We all know his technical skills. Now it's time to see him take the stage. So over to you, Farhan. Yeah, I'm audible. Yeah, you're audible, yeah. Hey, 
क्यों जुदाई दे गया तू ये सवाल आए थोड़ा समय खपा हो गया अपने आप से थोड़ा सा तुझ में भी बेवजा ये तड़पन है ये उलझन कैसे झील बिना तेरे मेरी अब सबसे अनपन बनते क्यों खुदा मेरे ओ ये जो लोग बाग है जंगल की आग है क्यों आग में जलू ये नाकाम प्यार में खुश है ये हार में इन जैसा क्यों बनू Okay, Farhan, that was a wonderful performance. Uh, we have I and Rakim here have a question for you. Rakim, you want to ask him? Mm, no, why don't you ask him? You know that was something even Moses did to us earlier. Wait, I have a question. I have. Yeah, go ahead. Okay, okay, go yeah, ahead. go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. It's for Farhan. Who hurt you, bro? Who hurt yeah. you, bro? Stand <laughs> oh, man, you just stole words from us. Who you hurt just you, stole bro? Words from us. Oh man, come on. <laughs> इतना दर्द है आवाज में डजन डिजर्व यू ब्रो शी डजन आई नो राइट इतना दर्द आवाज में कमेंट से द एटीएस इज ऑन फायर बट द एटीएस इज हार्ड ब्रोकन या फरान एक्साइट वांट्स टू नो हु हर्ट यू ब्रो नो अरे किसने किसने तेरा दिल तोड़ा रे किसने तेरा दिल तोड़ा दिस इज सो सैड This is so sad. <laughs> oh man! Oh, all, all jokes aside, all jokes aside, it was a wonderful performance, and yeah. thank you very much, Farhan. Okay, now it's time for some thing. Reckon? God, Glenn, stop it, man! Oh, Why are you so hell bent on destroying each and every concept of fun? You know, please stop it. Wait, wait, oh. <laughs> wait, 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 please. Okay, Before okay, okay. just right, right. we will now just get into a spookiest category, the horror story which we have been waiting, and for that we have Miss Kashika who is going to try to give us the chills. So let's grab a blanket or something to hold on to. Over to you, Kashika. Am I audible? Yeah, yes, yes. yes. A very good evening to everyone present to my house. The story that I'm going to tell you all is a real incident that. Happened with me last year in July. My father and I tested positive for COVID and we were admitted to hospital. On the day of my discharge, they uh, took my test and I was positive again. So instead of sending me to home, they sent me to a quarantine center where my mom was already there as she had to be quarantined for 14 days. I was allotted a room on the fifth floor. Since uh, fifth floor was a uh, lot uh, allotted for people who were positive, and I was the only positive person in that quarantine center, I was the only person on the fifth floor. The first day went really good as I was happy to see the outside world. I was in quarantine as I was in the hospital for so long. On the second day, from the evening, I started to experience something strange, like something is not right. I. Uh, experience some negative vibes, some spooky vibes coming from that floor. 
somehow i tried to there there was two key vibes coming from the room i packed myself in the room by uh, closing the doors and windows i also called my mom telling that i'm scared i don't know uh, something is not right over here she asked me uh, to open the windows as uh, opening the windows will make me feel good by getting some fresh air i did the same by listening her at the midnight when i was sleeping facing towards the wall the other side of the bed was completely uh, empty as i was the only person in the room i experienced something strange like i experienced someone was breathing uh, really loudly like deep breaths i can make out that person is inhaling or exhaling at that point of time i was shocked and terrified i was frozen at that time i it was a bone chilling experience for me somehow that night passed and i woke up in the morning and i consoled myself like yashika everything is right it was just a nightmare i urged my father to take me out of this quarantine center anyhow because in, i didn't want it to stay even a day over there the, my, luckily my father got discharged on the same day and he took me home after completing the 14 days of quarantine when my mom uh, returned back home she was uh, sharing her experience how she spent her days in the quarantine so here is where the main spooky part comes she said like she experienced something strange over there she one night when she was sleeping she heard someone was breathing really loudly in her room like th those were deep breaths like she could make out whether the person is inhaling or exhaling and she when she told me this i got scared and i the way that she described that incident it was quite similar to what i experienced at that point of time i shared my mom the same experience and we both were terrified scared and shocked we didn't know what happened with us and till till today when i think of that incident it scares me and it it is still a mystery what happened over there that's it. thank you thank you yashika it was it is fine chilling you know guys believe me but i get afraid even when when i'm walking alone and that wind passes by now bahut dar lagta hai sach bol raha hu bahut dar lagta hai acha nahi like that you know goosebumps aata hai i know right so yeah. now since we have heard such melodious voices and a bone chilling experience from yashika Let's have some giggles, and for that, I would like to call upon Mr. Rohit Prasad, and he's well prepared, I guess. Let's look at him in his action. Come on, let's go, Rohit. Hello, how is Arya? How is Arya, Miri? Arya, ha, Arya, bro, Arya, Arya, fantastic. Ha, fantastic. Gulu, gulu, antenna, ha, antenna, chal raha hai, bara, gulu, 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 ठीक है. तो guys, आज हम को बोला किसी ने कि टुडे इज हैलोवीन इट्स अ स्केरी डे स्पुकी डे तो मैं सोच रहा था कि हमारे यहाँ तो इतने त्योहार है ये हैलोवीन कहाँ से आता है वो हैलोवीन का मतलब क्या है तो कोई मेरे को कहा कि भूत बन के घूमते बच्चे चॉकलेट मिल जाती है चॉकलेट खा के खुश हो जाते बच्चे देन आई रिमेम्बर की वेन वी वर यंगर वी यूज टू गो टू हाउसेस We were, we would not get chocolates, but we were scared away. हमारे लाह रोज हैलोवीन था. Yeah, yeah, I know, I know. तालिबान वाले मेरे भाई हैं. मैं उनको अभी मैसेज करके बोलने वाला था. थोड़े टाइम में ऐसा शेलिंग बंद करने के लिए. So yeah, back to the story. Back to the story. Then then I remembered about the different uh, other festivals we have. अभी नवरात्रि चल रही थी नवरात्रि से सब लोग भूत बन के घूम रहे हैं इधर से उधर पसीने से लिपटे हुए कोई किसी का मेकअप उतर रहा है आंटी का मस्कारा से वो अलग दिख रही है एक आ, आंटी घूम रही है उनका पति बाजू से निकल पहचाना ही नहीं उनको क्या करेगा आदमी तो ऐसे ही करते 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 हमारा पूरा टाइम निकल जाता है एक घर के हमारे पीछे ए, सुबह पानी नहीं आता हम लोग को और हम लोग हेलोवीन बना रहे ए, चलो चलो बहुत पका लिया 
Now let's get back to the story. Yeah. Gulu, pani aagya. Chalo. Bye bye. Pani aagya, dosto. Chalo. Bye. No, I it. It felt like I was seeing Kejriwal. Yes, Hello, Rohit. Oh, nice. Nice. I'm going to go to the next one. I'm going to go to the next one. I'm going to go to the next one. I'm going to go to Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank you so much. You surely are the Tanmai part of XIE, I guess. And partly Moving KG1. On. <laughs> yeah, yeah, partly KG1. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Mm, now I would like to call upon the calm and composed Miss Chanel, who will be singing a song for us. Am I audible? Yes. Hey guys, I'm Chanel Athai, and today I'm going to sing A Thousand Years. Heart beats fast, colors and prom. Misses how to be brave. How can I love when I'm afraid to fall? But watching you stand alone, not my doubt, suddenly goes away somehow. One step close. I have died every day waiting for you Darling, don't be afraid I have loved you for a thousand years I love you for a thousand more Time stands still Beauty in all she is i will be brave i will not let anything take away what's standing in front of me every breath every hour has come to this one step close I have died every day waiting for you. Darling, don't be afraid. I have loved you for a thousand years. I love you for a thousand more. And all along I believe I will find you. Time has brought your heart to me. I have loved you for a thousand years. I love you for a thousand more. Thank you. Well, that was so soothing and well performed, Chanel. Such a melodious voice. Thank, thank you. you. Yeah, thank you for your performance. Uh, and who? Now on next Okay, that's done. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay, so our ne uh, what I was saying was our next participant would surprise you, and yes, surprise is the right word I'm using here because he is none other than our sports secretary, Sean Pereira. My, my, this guy is multi-talented. He's going to perform a song for us. So let's give him a round of applause. Over to you, Sean.
Well, we would not have expected this from our sports star to perform so well, man. <laughs> Didn't you reckon? I'm yeah. sure, Sean, that your guinea pigs and rabbits are standing beside you. With that said, let's move on to our next performer. Oh, these guys. These guys really have immense love for music. Well, I don't think they need an introduction now. We have Glenn and Moses for us once again. Hi guys, I'm Moses Fernandez. Hi, I'm Glenn Ferreira and we will be singing When You Say Nothing At All. So let's get right into it. It's amazing how you can speak right to my heart Without saying a word, you light up the dark Try as I may, I can never explain What I hear when you don't say a thing The smile on your face lets me know that you need me There's a truth in your eyes saying you'll never leave me The touch of your hand says you'll catch me Whenever I fall You say your best When you say nothing at all All day long I can hear People talking out loud But when you hold me near You can drown out the crowd so try as they may, they could never define What's been said between your heart and mine The smile on your face lets me know that you need me There's a truth in your eyes saying you'll never leave me The touch of your hand says you'll catch me wherever I fall you sing it best when you say nothing at all. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, guys. You are just kidding. It. It's amazing. You know that? Okay, so now we have Miss Merista. She has exceptional writing skills and is a pure gem of a person. And now she is here to startle us with her singing skills too. So over to you, Merisa. seem to focus and you don't seem to notice I'm not here I'm just a mirror you check your complexion to find your reflections all I 
said no, supposedly I'm lonely now We're not supposed to be unhappy without someone But aren't I someone? I love to be your answer you're so handsome But I know better Than to drive you home Cause you'd invite me in And I'd be yours again But I And you don't know her And I I'm in love But not with anybody here I see you in a couple Thank you. Damn, that was a wonderful and calming performance, Marisa. I know a singer when I see one, and I think the chat box is doing justice to what I say. So thank you very much for such a wonderful performance. Well, well, well. We have Rohan with us once again. And this time he's going to be playing the keyboard for us. Wow, man, what a truly multi talented guy. mind blowing you know believe me guys looking at the notes and playing the chords the same time with both hands is very difficult you know yeah he broke it he's just awesome man well so now we don't know how enthusiastic our seniors are about engineering but we do know one thing they are very enthusiastic about poetry and with this i would like to call upon a person who needs no introduction, Miss Lysandra. Over to you, Lysandra. Hi, everyone. Am I audible? Yeah, yes. you are. Yeah. 
Okay, so first of all, uh, before I begin, I mean, I'm pretty sure y'all have heard me uh, like recite poems a thousand of times, but then can we take a moment to just appreciate how well this event is going? And uh, okay, could we have some, you know, cams turned on? Wow, I even like the avatar that everyone has come up with and that makes me feel kind of uh, left out, but that's all right. I'm used to FOMO. So, uh, wow. And also, can we take some more, you know, just some little appreciation for how well our hosts are handling this and we are making sure that we don't have one dull moment over here and they're absolutely killing it in this online event. Could we have a round of applause for them, first of all? Thank you. Thank, thank, you, thank you, guys. You. Thank you so much. OK, so now uh, the piece that I'm going to perform is about something that this particular event lacks and that silence the only reason we don't have a silent and a dull moment over years because there's an overwhelming amount of talent let i think we all can agree on that right can we yes 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 yes, yes. indeed indeed okay and also since it's halloween themed and i think you're more spooked out in the silence let my piece is on silence so here's how it goes. Dear silence, should I treat you like a guest? For after dedicated meditation, with your abundance, I'm blessed. You're good to have around at first. A much needed break from my routine for all it's worth. You live in my head and there begins your charm. Reflecting on things that never before raised an alarm. I'd like to think you bring new perspective. Breaking shackles of pattern, I retrospect everything that I would have even remotely ignored, which in my present state of mind, I would appreciate and cherish even more. More silence, I dig in deeper to comb through galore of fleeting moments, to search where did I go wrong and to change those situations, how I feverishly long. Silence still hums while I look for a moment that will save me from the guilt that's making me so numb. I'm helpless, wishing why didn't I do better? Life is so short. Is this how bad regret hurts? It's painful, more than I think I can bear. It's a kind of despair no justification can deem fair. Making me notice all that I take for granted, giving me second thoughts from life, all that I wanted. But wait, how did I get here? I came here for a break. I'm not a space so severe. Ah, silence. Is this the effect that you have on all those who seek you and in you to reminisce? But you are wrapped in peace and unpredictable abyss. I treat you like a guest who has overstayed their visit. Resuming my pattern is the front to you I exhibit. In my mind, thankful for the much needed snap of thoughts. But what about the ones who never realize the deceptive plot? I hope addiction isn't their resort for a battle against you to be bravely fought. I hope no, they realize you. while you sit here and in my chain of thoughts, you triumphantly thrive. Sadly, silence is just not that you can take advantage of my vulnerable glum. No, that I fought you with my poem. I wonder was art one of the many attempts to conquer your deafening presence? For my poem is a result you've now become, and I'm not the slightest bit disappointed of this outcome. Thank you. Thank you so much. You know, that was sort of a given here. Yeah. She never fails to impress us. No doubt she is the editor in chief of the magazine. <laughs> Thank you. I am yeah. beyond flattered. <laughs> Thank you for performing such a lovely piece for us. I no matter how tough you are. Okay, so for now, our next participant is the quick-witted and multi-talented Brian. He has some amazing graphic skills, but now he is here to dazzle us with his singing skills too. So over to you, Brian. Oh, the 
fire Hard and fast and angry as she can be I walk my days on a wire He looks ugly But it's clean Oh mama don't forsook me The way she tells me I'm hers and she's mine Open hand or close fist would be fine The blood is rare and sweet as cherry wine Calls a guilty thrown at me Oh while she stings the sheets of some other Thrown at me so powerfully Just like she throws With the arm of her brother But I want it It's a crime That she's not around most of the time The way she shows me I'm hers And she's mine Open hand or close fist would be fine The blood is red and sweet as cherry wine Her fight and fury's fiery over she looks Like sleep to the freezing Sweet and right and merciful I'm all but washed in the tide of her breathing and it's worth it it's divine I have this summer time the way she shows me I'm hers and she's mine open hand or close fist Blood is rare and sweet as cherry wine. Thank you, Brian. That was indeed a dazzling performance. And that was very entertaining as well. You probably are going to get designated as Class Romeo after this song. So, good luck with that. <laughs> so now, I would like to request all of you to turn on your cams to come on with this event. Guys, come on, on your Guys, cams. come on, turn your cams. You can do pose like this or hard beat like that. I can see empty tiles over here. Nim okay, he looks like he's busy with the guinea pigs. Ah. Okay, is everyone here? Mm. Okay, now since it's Halloween theme, can we all do some scary posts for the camera while Brian clicks the screenshots? Okay, can I get some scary poses? Oh no, Chinmay, come on, at least you. I can't see, thumbs up, I need to post <laughs> Okay, come on. At least I and Re I and Rick and we are we are vampires, think, right? So come on. Tell me, tell me when you're ready. Tell me when you're ready. Oh God. <laughs> oh yeah, 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 yeah. We are all ready. Come on. Jimmy, yeah, I okay. can't see your post. Uh, like one hand creepily in the air. If yeah, that something like that. See Sean. <laughs> yes. <laughs> okay. Three, two, one. Cheese. I think booyah or oh. something would make more sense, but okay. Whatever, whatever uh, gets your vibe, I guess. And nothing would make sense for me. <laughs> All right, class okay, Romeo. Okay, looks like we are right. done. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We are done. We are done. Yeah, we're done. We're done.